All right, so for those who are just joining us, welcome. I just sent the playlist in the chat. If you don't have it, it is the same playlist from the past couple of weeks. So no changes there, so you're good. And then five o'clock, I think it's five o'clock. I know I was watching five seconds till five o'clock. Okay, well, I'm gonna start anyways. Uh, hi, five o'clock burn. My name is Abby. If you've never taken my class before, I've got Abby taking class as well. Um, thanks for joining me on this cold winter yet spring day. Um, for class today, I have one set of weights, completely optional. If you have a set of weights at home and you'd like to use them, go for it. You can also improvise. You can do this body weight, whatever your body feels and needs and wants. And then I also have a, Abby has a ball for class. This is going to be used at the end of class for core. We're going to be doing it from a boat pose. Um, I'm going to do it with nothing below me, but if you have something like a pillow or other kind of squishy stuff, like objects nearby and would like to use that for your back, um, you can go ahead and grab that now. You can grab it later. You can grab it during cardio if you kind of want to dip out. By all means, go for it. Um, but anyways, that's what we've got going today. So um, just a reminder, classes for tomorrow will be sent out later tonight. So with that, are we all good to go? Yeah. Okay. So um, let's go ahead and get started in extended child's pose with our knees open wide, hands at the top of our mat, just beginning to connect with your breath. Beginning to inhale deep through your nose. Exhale out your mouth, let it go. Deep through your nose. Inhale, fill up. Hold it at the top. Exhale, let it go. Now continuing to use that breath as a way to stretch to guide your practice on your next inhale, I'd like you to raise your hips just an inch higher off your heels. And on your exhale, go ahead and stick them a little bit closer, maybe reaching your fingertips a little bit closer to the top of your mat, maybe opening your fingertips, connecting all 10 finger pads to your mat, bringing your head to a slight rock, side to side, begin to massage out the temple or the center between your brows. So you need to relax, be connected with your mat, being connected with the space within the next 60 minutes. You have taken the time to be on your mat. I encourage you to be present, to be the best version of yourself here within this community, within yourself. Now, option here to flip your palms towards the sky, send intention for class. Maybe it's a word or a phrase that you've had to hold on to over the past couple of weeks, a word that's gonna keep you going. Keep yourself motivated during these times. Like to use that word through our class as a way to push yourself, to strengthen yourself. When you don't think you can go any farther, you can and you will. So with that, take a big inhale through your nose, fill up. Exhale, let it go. Let's flip our palms back towards the mat this time. Take two more breaths here. Big inhale through your nose. Exhale out your mouth. Last breath here before moving to a tabletop position and starting your music. Fill up deep through your nose. Exhale, let it go. All right, starting your music now. On an inhale, we rise to a tabletop position. Begin to find some organic movement, tipping side to side, forward and back. Let your head hang heavy. Let your hips move whichever way they feel, maybe moving a little bit back and forth. Stretch out the backs of your shoulders. Maybe beginning to move your back in a cat and cow-like motion, nothing too big. Just beginning to warm up the body. But wherever you are, take a few more counts. Keep in a neutral tabletop position, zipping your core in tight, stacking your shoulders over your wrists, your hips over your knees. We take a big inhale here. Drop your belly, lift your gaze, cow pose. Chin is lifted, heart is open. On our exhale, we round out our spine, cat pose. Letting your head hang heavy here. Inhale, drop your belly, lift your gaze. Tail around through that spine, using your whole breath, moving nice and slow, vertebrae by vertebrae. Inhale, drop your belly, lift your gaze. Exhale, let it go, round that spine, let your head hang heavy, really push into your mat, active motions. Take two more rounds of cat and cow, here we go. Inhale. Exhale, round that spine, here we are. 
Take your last round of cat and cow. Biggest one yet. Exhale, let it go. Really round that spine. Push into it on your inhale. We come to a neutral tabletop position. Aligning with the crown of our head with our hips. Straight back. Just really beginning to feel. Reactivate that core if you've lost it. On an inhale, flipping your toes, lifting your knees two inches off the mat. We hold. All right, moving to step back, starting with the right. Step the right foot back and in. Left and in. Here we go. It's right and in. Left. Four. Three. Down dog in two. And one. On your last step back, flipping your hips high. Pedal it out. Sink into those shoulders. Lift your booty up high. Let this feel good. It's our first down dog of class. Taking any extra movements, maybe moving your heels at the same time. Really let your head just hang, release all the tension in your neck. Maybe shake your head, yes, shake it, no. We're here for four, three. Right leg lifts in two, and one. Inhale, lift your right leg high. Exhale, bend the knee, roll out the knee, the hip, the ankle, moving right, moving left. Whichever way you're going now, go ahead and reverse that direction. On an inhale, fly that leg high. On an exhale, draw the knee to nose, crunch it in, bring it all the way through. Inhale, fly high. Exhale, draw it all the way through, lunge pose. Drop your knee, lift your chest. Option, bring your arms high. Option, bring your hands to your knees. Keeping your knee over your ankle. Maybe find a side body stretch, moving towards the right side. Using your breath to guide the movement, inhale, raise, exhale, sink. On a big inhale, we come back to center, exhale, we send our hips back, hamstring stretch, flex the front foot. Maybe sitting back on your heel if that feels better for you. Inhale, lift your chest, exhale, sink it a little bit closer to your foot. Do one more of those here. Inhale, lift your chest. Exhale, sink a little bit closer. Inhale, shift it forward. Exhale, flipping your toes, lifting your chest. Just hold that lunge pose. We go from a straight leg to a bend leg. We straight and bend. Straight. For four. Three. We're here for two. And one on your next lunge. Inhale here. Exhale, fly that right leg high. Inhale. Exhale, come back to down dog. Pedal it out. Hope you're feeling a little bit looser on the right side, but we have two legs, so it's time to stretch out the other side. On your next inhale, fly the left leg high this time. Exhale, bend the knee, roll up the ankle, the hip. Moving both ways. Inhale, fly that leg high. Exhale, draw that knee to nose. Activate the core. All the way in. Inhale, fly that leg high. Exhale, draw it all the way through. Lunge pose. Drop your knee. Lift your chest. Nice and high. Again, remembering to inhale, lift. Exhale, sink. Option also to find a side body stretch. Moving towards your left leg. Whatever feels good in your body. Inhale here. Exhale, stretch. On your next inhale, come back to center. Exhale, we push our hips back, hamstring stretch. Flexing the front foot. Inhale, lift your chest. Exhale, sink it down. Inhale, lift. Exhale, sink a little lower. Wherever you are, inhale, shift it forward, lunge, pose, exhale, flipping your toes, lifting your knees, going from those bent legs to a straight leg. We straight and bend, we straight and bend. For four, three, two, and one, find that left leg high, here we go. Come back to that down dog. Take any extra movements you need here, maybe coming down to your knees, stretching out your arms, maybe rolling out those shoulders if your legs need a little extra love. 
Maybe stretching out the hip flexors in a figure four stretch. It's a little bit colder outside our body. We need a little bit more to warm up. For four. For three, if you have your weights, bring them each to the side of your mats for two. Grab your weights in one, finding a high plank pose. Weights are on opposite sides of our mats. Just finding that high plank pose to begin with, stacking your shoulders over your wrists, sending energy throughout your heels, keeping your glutes in line with your shoulders in line with the crown of your head. For four, we're strong for three. Knee taps in, two, and one. Knee taps, here we go, it's lower and left, right and left, stay strong for eight, for seven, how many, six, for five. Here we are for four, we hold it high in three, we hold high in two, Hold it high in one. If you have your weights or would like to use your weights, bringing your weights right under your shoulders at this time, staying in that high plank pose, option to just continue holding. From your high plank pose, starting with the right side, optional weight. We need pull and press. Pull and press, alternating right and left. Pull and press. If you have no weights, go ahead and press. Here we are. Engage in your back. Eight. Or seven. Yes, you can. Four, six. Four, five. Squeeze your core. Option drop to those knees. Eliminate this way. For four. We're here for three. Hold high in two. Hold high in one. Holding that high. Inhale through your nose. Exhale out to your mouth. Moving your weight to the outside of your mats. Coming back to that high plank. Moving a little bit to our obliques and side planks. Opening it up. Putting, uh, putting our weight on our right arm. Flying our arm high. We lower and lift. Lower and lift. Lift. And low, squeeze, squeeze. Option to maybe float that top leg if you need a little extra challenge. We're here for eight, four, seven. Hold it high in six. We've got five. Hold high in four, in three. Hold high in two, hold high in one. Holding that arm high. Oblique crunches with an arm behind our head. We lower and lift, oblique crunch. Option to come to your knees, lower and lift, lower and lift. Count it down, four, eight, four, seven. You've got six, left side in five. How many, four, in three. Other side in two. And one, moving through that high plank, nice and strong, flying that arm high. Hip dips, here we go. Lower and lift, it's lower and lift. So strong, lower and lift. Four, eight, seven, four, six. Here we are, it's five. Four, four, hold high in three and two. We hold high in one, flying that arm behind our head, oblique crunches. Here we go. It's lower and lift, lower and lift. Really twisting from your oblique to lower down. Eight, seven, how many? Six, four, five, four, three. Come to a four and play game two. And one, coming to a forearm plank. Bringing your glutes in line with your shoulders. Stay strong here. Eight, seven, dolphin push-ups in six, five, flash variation for four. Four, three, sending our hips high in two. Dolphin push-ups in one, send it up and down. We squeeze and lower, lift and lower, lift. 
and whip. For eight, yes you can, it's seven. You've got six. For five, looking good. Four, three, just a hold in two. And one, just a hold, lower hold. Four on plank for eight, seven, six, five, it's four. Three, release in two, and one, drop it back. Come to a child pose, good work, guys. Good round of planks, should be nice and warm by this point. Grabbing a sip of water and your weights if you'd like. Come to the top of your mat. Squat today starting, hips are directly under your body. About hip distance apart or slightly further. Popping the right heel up. Send energy through your ball mop. We lower, four, two, we lift. Lower, two, lift. Lower, two, Lift, right heel is lifted, chest is strong, glutes are squeezing, lower, two, lift. Arms can be a heart center or down by your side. Lower, two, lift, here we are. For four, three, single it out, in two, one, drop it low. It's lower and lift, lower and lift. For eight, seven, really press through that ball ball. For six, five. For four, three, hold low. Two, one, hold it low. Find that low squat. I'm just gonna add a pulse. Pulse, pulse, pulse. For eight, seven, little lower. Six. Five, little lower, four, four, three, toe taps, two, one, just the right foot, taps out, end in, out, end in, so good, out, end in, remember to stay low in that leg, squeeze the core, tuck your hips under, eight, seven, six, five, come back to that pulse in four, in three, Back to pulses in two, and one. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Can you get lower than the last time? For eight, seven, six, five, singles four, three, singles two, drop it low. It's lower and lift, lower and lift. Really squeezing through the quads. For eight, seven, so good. For six, five, left heel in four, in three, left heel pops in two, and one, dropping your right heel, lifting the left this time. We lower for two, we lift for two. Same thing on this side. Lower and lift, lower, two, lift. So good. For eight, seven, and six. Five, push yourself. Four, three, singles, two. One, single it out. It's lower and lift. Boom, and lift. Squeeze your glutes to help it press your body up. For eight, seven, six, five. You know what's coming in. Four, three, pulse low in two. One, pulse or hold, pulse, pulse, or a hold, and hold. Remember to inhale through your nose, exhale out your mouth. Here we go for eight, seven, six, five, toe taps, three, two, tap, and in, tap, and in. Stay low in that leg. Can the left, right leg get a little bit lower? I bet it can. Count it down. Eight, seven, count out loud. For six, no one can hear you, I promise. Seven, it's five, sorry. Four, we pulse it three. Two and one, pulse it low and low. 
Inhale through your nose. Exhale out your mouth. You can do this. Here we are. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Singles. Two. One. Drop it low. Here we go. It's lower and lift. Lower and lift. Lower and lift. Eight. Seven, six, five. It's four, three, two, and one. Coming up, bringing your weight to the top of your mat. Stiletto squats. Weight your fingertips to your mat. Here we go. Lower, two stiletto squats. Heels can stay lifted or lower. Lower, two. Lift for two. Lower, two. Lift for two. Keep a slight bend in your knees the whole time. Lift, low. Lift, lower, count it down. It's eight, seven. You've got six. For five, pulse low in four. And three, pulse in two. One, pulse it low. Here we go. It's pulse and pulse. Maybe an option here, bringing your hands off your weights or off your mat. Can you stay nice and lifted? Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, singles, two, and one. Here we go. It's lower and lift. Single it up. Lower and lift. For eight. Seven, so good. For six, for five, we're here for four, for three, for two, one, pulse it high, pulse it up, and up, up, pulse, pulse, pulse. I know it burns. Count it down. You've got eight, seven, for six, Five, remember your breath. Four, four, three. Come up in two. One, coming up to the top of your mat. Toe, heel your feet to the outside of your mat. Heel on the corner of your mat. Toes are up. Goblet squats. Four, two, lift. Four, two. Four, two, lift. Four, two, lift. Targeting the outside of our legs this time. For eight, seven, for six, for five. We're here for four, three, add a smile. Froggies in two, one, coming down. Here we go. We lift and low, lift and lower, lift and low. Really digging your elbows into your knees. Eight, seven, six. Five, four, goblets in three, in two, goblets in one. Here we go, last round. We lift for two, we lower for two. Lift, low, lift, embrace that burn. Let's count it down. It's eight, seven, you got six, five. Froggies, four, three, yes you can, four, two, one, froggy it out. We lift and lower, lift and lower, maybe bringing your fingertips to the ground for a little extra support, even an inch. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, release in two. And one, good work for coming to your knees. Grab a sip of water if that feels good. Hopefully everyone's feeling some burn in their legs at this point. We're gonna switch directions. Come to the stomach or come to a lane position on your stomach. For shoulder work today, we're gonna be working for primarily here. Key here, dig the tops of your feet into the ground, into the mat. This will help target the upper body. So 
starting with just an upper body super mid, nice and isolated. Hands are at a goal post 90 degrees. We lift and lower. Lift and lower. Digging your feet in. Here we are. No matter how high you get, all about pushing yourself each time. For eight, seven, for six. You've got five, for four, for three, and two. Hold it low in one, keeping those arms at a goal pose. We extend to a V position, pull in. Extend, pull in. Thinking V to W, a V to W. Think about pushing your shoulder blades together as they come back for eight, seven, Six, five, four, three. We're here for two, one. Bringing your hands to your mat. Let your body relax a little bit. That can be really intense in the upper body. Just relax for four, four, three. Back to those Supermans in two. And one, arms at goal post or maybe behind your head this time. We lift and lower, lift and lower. Remembering to dig the tops of your feet into your mat as much as possible for eight, seven. You've got six, five, squeeze your body, four, three, two, one. Lowering your body just above the mat. Extend to a T, pull in. T to W, T to W, T, T. Remembering your breath for eight, seven, six, five, for four, three, two, one. Take a four count rest. Here we go. For four, four, three, four, two, and one. Lifting your body this time, bringing your hands straight out in front of you, coming to creating a ball with your hands like this at the top of your mat. We come to a T and round. T to ball. T to ball. If this is too much on your back, feel free to come to a seated position. Same thing. T to ball. T to ball. For eight, seven. Push down on those shoulders for six. For five, for four, three, two, one. Back those W's. Pull in, extend. Maybe resting your head at the top of your mat if that feels good. Press those elbows together. Pull in, together. For eight, seven. Burn those shoulders. For six. For five, for four, we're here for three, for two, and one. Resting down, sit it back, come to a child's pose, stretch out the tops so of the shoulders that offer back. When you are ready, if you have your weights, bring them to the sides of your mat, move into a little bit more upper body work, find your push up position from your knees or from your toes whatever you choose to do. Finding our push-up pose from our plank position, same thing. Pointers and thumbs on the sides of our mats and three fingers on the outside of your mats. Again, from your knees or from your toes, whatever you are comfortable with. 10 basic push-ups in four, in three, 10 push-ups in two, and one. It's 10, it's nine, it's eight. Here we go. It's seven. It's six. We're almost halfway. It's five. We're halfway. In four. In three. We find a halfway pulse in two. And one. We come halfway. We pulse. We pulse. Pulse. For eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One, just hold, hold that halfway position. Yes, you can. So strong, so strong for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. 
five, it's four, three, push it back in, two, and one, pushing it back. If you have your weights, go ahead and grab them at this time. Little bit of bicep work. We sit up off our heels, sending our glutes forward, activating our core. If you need a little extra work, sink it back about four inches. Basic bicep curl. Lift and lower. Basic bicep curl. Here we go. Elbows pinned in for eight, seven, four, six. Five, it's four, it's three. Hold halfway in two, and one, become halfway. Rotating out and in, out and in. Little extra shoulder work. Whoo! Hopefully everyone's feeling that burn, I know I am. Eight, seven, Six, five, it's four, three, bicep curls in two, wide arms in one, it's lower and lift, lower, lift, option here, go one at a time, lift and lower. Eight, seven, six. Four, three, hold halfway, two, one, come halfway, stacking your wrist gently above or slightly above those elbows. Here we go. We hold, we pulse, 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 pulse. Squeeze those biceps. Mind to body activation here for eight, seven, it's six, just an inch for five, it's four. Three, back to our push-ups in, two, one, bringing those weights down, come back to your push-ups. Got another round of 10, option here to, as you lower down, to lift one leg, as you lower. That means five lifts on each side, otherwise stick with those push-ups. Here we go, set it up, we go in four, in three, two, one, it's 10, it's nine, it's eight, Seven, here we go for six, for five, halfway there in four, in three, you know what's coming in two, halfway pulse in one, here we go, it's pulse, it's pulse, pulse, for eight, seven, six, four, five, it's four, three, two, hold in one, halfway, here we go, push yourself, how strong are you? So strong for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Grab your weights in one, sinking it back. Option to grab those weights if you've got them, sitting up off our heels. Hammer curls, lift and lower. Palms are facing each other. You have your weights, maybe try wiggling a couple fingers off, releasing that death grip. For eight, it's seven. Four, six, five, it's four, it's three, come halfway in two, and one, bringing your weights halfway, halfway lifts, halfway lower, lift halfway, come halfway, lower, halfway, lift, full range here, but making an emphasis to stop halfway, halfway, lower, lift. Lower. We're here for eight. For seven. So good. For six. For five. For four. Three. Two. One. Bringing your weights about 45 degrees from your thighs. We lift and lower, lift, and lower, lift, and lower, for eight, seven, you've got six, for five, four, three, two, and one, last one here, good work, Dropping those weights, sending your push-ups, last round of push-ups, this time, chaturanga push-ups, we've been here before. Wrists are directly under your shoulders, from your knees or from your toes, gliding your elbows right by your stomach. You've got 10, here we go. It's 10, it's nine, eight, 
our triceps off with some tricep dips. Option to be supported from your glutes. Option to come all the way up. Fingers face the heels. It's lower and lift. Lower and lift. Lower and lift. Remembering to squeeze that core. Here we go. It's eight. It's seven. Six. For five. For four. We pulse low in three. Two, one, pulse at eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good work, grab a sip of water. Moving your weights away from you if you have them. Coming to the top of your mat, a little bit of cardio, a little bit shorter today. Start jumping that rope, here we go. Cardio today is gonna be three rounds of burpees, 10 rounds, or 10 rounds of burpees, oh goodness. 10 burpees in each round. We'll have a break between them, don't you worry. Take any modification you need to remove the jump, remove the, if you wanna add a push up, if you wanna just do a plank walkout. Whatever you need to do, we keep that body moving. So jump in your rope. You have your first set in eight, seven, six, five, four, three. 10 burpees in two and one. Here we go. 10, nine. It's eight, so good. Push yourself, here we go. Six, wherever you're at, it's five. Heel kicks in four, in three. Heel kicks in two, and one. Heel kicks, kicks, kicks. All right, we're a third of the way there. Feeling good, feeling good. All right, you've got another round of burpees coming up here. Whatever modifications you need to take to make this the best round you've done, take them now, all ready? Maybe adding a tuck jump at the top, maybe adding an extra push up, whatever that is. Here we go in eight, seven, six, five, ten push ups. Three, two, one. Here we go, ten burpees. Maybe doing a nice step back. I love it. Here we go. That's eight. You've got seven. Here for six. So good, it's five. Here we are in four. Football runs in three. Football runs in two. And one. Football runs. Here we are. How fast can you go? Can you get lower in those legs? Maybe swing those arms. One set of burpees left, that's all you've got. Here we are, making the best round, maybe adding, taking away. In eight, seven, it's six, five, ten burpees in four, three, ten burpees in two, and one, here we go. Push yourself, best round yet, I know this. Here we are, so strong. You're on eight. Seven, it's six, five. Here we are for four, three, two. Skaters in one, skate it out, skate it out. For eight, seven, it's six, four, five, it's four, it's three. Grab your water in two, and one. Best or worst part of class is over. Grab a sip of water. Keep that heart rate, heart rate going by cooling down your body. Chest stays lifted, head above the heart. Moving on to our recovery. Feet are hip distance apart. Turn them out, heels towards each other. Arms can be out alongside of you. We lift, calf raises. We lift and lower. Lower and lift, lower and lift. It's eight. It's seven, we're here for six, five, four, in three. We would hold it high in two, and one, holding your heels high, arms are extended long, flipping your palms towards the sky, raise the roof, Madonna arms, here we are. Eight, seven, six, five, press it down, three, two, one, press it down, palms are down. Kind of like dribbling a ball. Shoulders are away from our ears. 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, palms forward, two, and one. Here we go. It's forward. Press, press, press. Heels stay lifted. Engage those calves. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, pump back in two, and one. Pulse back. Press, press, press. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Holding those arms again. Calf raises. Here we go. It's lower and lift. Lower and lift. Lower, squeeze. Lower, squeeze. Pressing to the tops of those feet. Eight, seven, you got six, five, we pulse in four, in three, pulse those heels, in two, one, pulse those heels halfway. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Yes, you can. Remember in your breath. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, hold high in two, and one, holding those legs high, pressing your palms up towards the sky. Here we go. Raise the roof. Lift and lift. Lift for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Palms down in two, and one. Here we go. Press, press, press. Option to drop those heels if that does not feel good for you. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Palms forward, two, and one. Press, press. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Palms back in two, and one. Palms back, back, back. Press, press. Shoulders are down, backs engaged. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. With our arms long, last little set here. Combining the calf raise as we lower down when you lift, form a ball. Lower and lift, lower and lift. For eight, for seven, hit six. For five, like a ballerina for four. Release in three, in two, and one. Shake it out. We are on our mats for the rest of class. Come to that tabletop position. From a tabletop option, to put a weight behind your hip, behind your knee if that feels good. Starting with the right side, flexing the foot, donkey kicks. Lift and low. Lift and lower. Squeezing your core tight, eliminating any cat and cow movement. For eight, for seven, we're here for six, for five, for four, for three, two, one. Keeping that leg lifted, straightening the leg, pointing the foot. Crossovers, here we go. Lower and lift. Toe comes to the opposite side of the mat. Lower. And lift, lower, squeeze, eight, seven, for six, for five, yes you can, for four, for three, two, one, bringing your leg back to center, little circles, corner side, eight, seven, Six, five, reverse in four, three, reverse in two, and one, other way, reverse, reverse, for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, keeping your leg lifted, squeeze the glutes, flex the foot, drawing our knee to our shoulder, and press, draw it in, and press, Coming leg comes to a fire hydrant. Here we go. For eight, for seven, for six, five, four, it's three, it's two. Fire hydrants in one. Here we go. It's lower and lift. Lower and lift. Squeeze those glutes. Keep them tight. For eight, for seven, 
right way to the other side. We lift and lower. Donkey kicks. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Feeling the glute squeeze as you lift. Using your core to draw the leg back in. For eight. For seven. For six. Here for five. For four. For three. For two. Last one, keeping that leg lifted. Extend the leg, point the foot. Cross over as the foot comes to the opposite side of your mat. Lower, squeeze. Diagonal, squeeze. Keeping the core tight. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale for eight, for seven, for six, for five. We're here for four, for three. Circles in two. And one, keep that leg high. Circle it out. For eight, seven, six, five, reverse in four, three, reverse in two, and one, other way, reverse, reverse. For eight, seven, six, five, flex your foot, and three, and two, and one, flexing that foot, drawing our knee to our elbow, and push. Squeeze and push. Keep the glutes lifted for eight. For seven, you've got six. For five, five hydrants, four. Four, three, five hydrants, two. And one, fire hydrants. We lower and lift, load. And lift, push yourself. We count it down for eight, for seven, here for six, for five, for four, for three, last two, last one, set it back. Option to grab your pillow or ball or nothing at this time. All right, keeping your chest lifted, coming to a boat pose, arms extended long, we lower and lift, lower and lift. If you have a pillow or a ball of some kind behind you, keep it on your lower back. You should feel it engaged, maybe just like curvature for eight, for seven, for six, for five, for four, Three. We add our marches in two. And one. Here we go. Draw it in and down. Left. Right. Left. Crunch. Crunch. For eight. Seven. Six. Five. It's four. Three. Palsy right. In two. And one, pulse it right, 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 and right. For eight, seven, and six, five, four, three. Marches in two. One, back to marches, here we go, and low, lift, and lower. Maybe floating your legs. Lift and lower. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Pulse left in two. One, pulse in left. Here we go. Pulse, pulse. For eight, seven, six, 
Single crunches, lifting lower, lift and lower, lift, lower, eight, seven, six, five, pulse in four, in three, pulse high in two, one, pulse in high, for eight, seven, six, five, release in four, three, release in two, and one, long body stretch. Inhale deep through your nose. Exhale out your mouth. Inhale through your nose. Exhale out your mouth. Just allowing your body a few moments here to soak up all the hard work you just put into the last 55 minutes. Blinking your eyes shut at this time, just allowing yourself to have some space to tune in with your body, with your mind. And on an inhale, draw that knee towards your chest. Moving it right, moving it left. And on an inhale, draw that knee a little bit closer to your chest and exhale, send it across your body for a side body stretch. Letting both shoulders stay connected to the mat. Take a big inhale, lift your leg. Exhale, allow that knee to sink. Inhale through your nose. Exhale out your mouth. On your next inhale, draw that knee back towards your chest. Give it a nice squeeze and switch it out for the other leg at this time, bringing your left leg towards your chest, moving it right, moving it left. And on an inhale, draw that knee closer to your chest. And on an exhale, send it across your body, side body stretch. Letting your knee go as far as gravity will take it. Letting your shoulders hang heavy against the mat. Inhale through your nose. Exhale out your mouth. Inhale, little lift. Exhale, sink. Inhale, draw the knee back towards your chest. Option here is to take a happy baby, maybe finding a figure four. If you are taking a figure four, ensuring that you have a flexed foot, protecting the joints and the legs. Happy babies, maybe extending one knee and then the other, rocking back and forth, side to side, massaging out your lower back. Figure four is maybe on an inhale, you release and exhale, you bring your knee a little bit closer to your chest. If you have not found the opposite side, I encourage you to do that at this time. So lacing your hands between your thighs and on the inhale, lift and exhale, pull that knee back towards your chest. Wherever you are, Bringing both knees in towards your chest, tucking your chin. Exhale all the air from your body, from your lungs. Let it all go. And on your next inhale, draw as deep as you can through your nose. Fill up. Fill up your belly, fill up your lungs. Fill up the space in your nose. And on exhale, let it go. Final Shavasana. Letting your body lay long, your feet hang heavy. Letting your tongue release from the top your mouth. Encourage you to come back to that word of that phrase that you came to at the beginning of class. Whatever that word or that phrase is, circling back being present with that word, how you're going to bring yourself to use the motivation and the energy you just sent in your day today, on your mat and off your mat. 
spreading the positive energy in the time of chaos and the time of unknown. I encourage you to connect with your mat during these times. It is a known place, a safe place, a positive space. You are welcome to lay as long as you like on your mat. It is your time, it is your space. If you're ready to be guided out of your Shavasana, begin to wiggle your toes and your fingers. Just moving the energy up to your ankles and your wrists, ever so gently, ever so slightly. Moving up to the elbows and the knees. Find a little bit more movement, rocking the head side to side. Maybe wiggling your jaw back and forth, seeing how different that feels. Eventually moving your shoulders and your hips to find a seated position at the top of your mat. Coming into a seated position, exhaling all the air from your body, let it go. Blinking your eyes shut, inhale, draw your hands to heart center. Exhale, let it go. Take a big inhale here together. Maybe peace in your heart, drawing your hands to your lips. Maybe peace in your words, drawing your hands to your third eye center, the space between your brows. Maybe peace in your mind and your thoughts. I am thinking of each and every one of you. Thank you for spending your time, your energy, your space with me, with each other in this community. Most importantly, with yourself. The student light teacher and me honors the student light teacher and every single one of you about four and namaste.